bill to be I would say this. this. There is no one that cutting corporate tax rates doesn't touch. Whether you're a consumer and products get cheaper or wages go up, it touches you. And people out there, people on the other side, will say that companies are just going to do, you know, they're have the stock price go up, that they're going to, um, you know, hand the money out to their shareholders. Then their competition will lower prices and raise wages for their workers. That's the beauty of competition. If companies hoard those tax cuts, they won't be in business much longer. There's no one this won't touch, especially now that there's a decrease in almost every bracket. I think this is going to lead to huge growth, and I would bet my bottom What's dollar. Huge yes. Sir Francis, can I ask a question? Please. What happens when those corporations decide that those morsels are too tasty and they're not going to share at the rate at which you were describing? It just doesn't historically happen. That, that I'm they, just asking the question. That they lower prices, then the competition comes in and does it. I mean, there's always someone hungrier that's willing to cut prices and have a thinner margin there no in other order to get the business. In the market, right? But don't we think that talking no to other people... accountability in the market? That's what yeah. our entire system is based okay. on. I'm just but don't market. we think that talking to people directly in the middle class? and detailing to them that their taxes are going to be lower is more effective than talking about corporations? I think people have to see it. I don't think talking convinces anyone of anything. I think people have to see their paycheck grow for whatever reason, and then they feel better. Otherwise, they're like, I'm too busy making dinner. Don't talk yeah, to me I later. I think 